One day, a monkey met a turtle on the road and asked, Where are you going? I am going to find something to eat, for I have no food for three whole days. I too am hungry, and since we are both hungry, let us go together and hunt food for our stomach's sake. They soon became good friends and chatted along the way. So, did the time pass quick, quickly? Before they had gone far, the monkey saw a large bunch of yellow bananas on a tree at the distance. But the third... Huh? Oh! What a good sight that is! Don't you see the bananas hanging on that banana tree? They are fine. I can taste them already. But the turtle was short-sighted and could not see them. By and by, they came near the tree, and then he saw them. The two, the two friends were very glad. The mere sight of the ripe yellow fruit seemed to assuage their hunger. What a lovely banana! But I cannot climb. I will climb. Then I will just throw some of the fruit down. The turtle agreed. The the turtle agreed that the monkey should go up alone and should throw some of the fruit down to him. The monkey was up in a flash and seating himself comfortably. He began to eat the finest of, of the fruit and forget to drop in down to the turtle waiting below. Give me some! I am very hungry! But the monkey pretended not to hear. He ate even the peelings and refused to drop a bit to his friend who was patiently begging under the tree. At last, the turtle became angry, very angry. Fine then, I will get my revenge. While the monkey was having a good time and feeling his stomach, the turtle gathered sharp, broken pieces of glass and stuck them one by one all around the banana tree. Then he hid himself under a coconut shell not far away. This shell had a hole in the top to allow the air to enter. That was why the turtle chose it for his hiding place. Ah, that was good. I'm so full now. Maybe I'll get down now. What are these sharp glass all around? I cannot go down. But the monkey continued to go down. Ouch! Ouch! The monkey had a hard time and his hands were cut in many places. The turtle thought he had the revenge and was not so angry as before. Ha 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 ha! Now I got my revenge, the sir. But the monkey was still very angry at the trick that had been played upon him and began looking for the turtle, intending to kill him. Hey turtle, where are you? Where were you, my friend? For some time, he could not find his foe. And being very tired, he sat down in a cotton shell nearby. His weariness increased his anger at the turtle very much. He sat on the shell for a long time, suffering from his wounds and wondering where to find the turtle, his former friend. But now he's enemy. Because of the disturbance of the shell, the turtle inside could not help making a noise. Ah! Oh, you're so heavy! Move yourself! This is the monkey heard, and he was surprised, for he could not determine whence where the sound came. At last, he looked at his stool, and there found his fool, the turtle. Ha! Here you are! Pray now, for it is the end of your life! He picked up the turtle by the neck and carried him near the riverbank, where he meant to kill, kill him. He took a mortar and pestle and built a big fire, intending to pound him to powder, powder or burn him to death. When everything was ready, he told, he told the turtle, Where do you want to die? In the fire or be grounded in the water? Oh, please! Monkey, please! Spare my life! Please! Please! <laughs> no chance! Then throw me then throw me either rich, but please, just don't throw me in the water, please. Oh, <laughs> I'll throw you in the water, then goodbye. The monkey picked the turtle up in his green fingers, and with all his might, might threw him into the middle of the stream. And the turtle was very glad. He chuckled at his own wit and laughed at the foolishness of the monkey. He came up to the surface of the water and mocked at the monkey, saying, 
Ha ha ha! I fooled you! This is my home! The water is my home! This made the monkey so angry that he lost his self-perception entirely. He jumped into the middle of the river after the turtle. You cannot escape! I will get you! Now, the monkey was drowning. Help! Please help! I cannot swim! Luckily, the flowing water brought the monkey to the side of the river and was able to survive. Since that, since that day, monkeys and turtles have been bitter enemies.